Matt Burke, Director of Football Development. So last year and the years past, Regional Combine has basically been just an open call. Anybody could come and work out. So what you're getting was a lot of uh, draft eligible the college seniors whose eligibility was up in college coming to work out. But then you get even more guys who maybe were out a year or two or three or four, uh, maybe some guys with previous experience. There was a large number of, of, of guys working out. And um, just so to streamline the process a little more, what we did this year was our regional combines, we made uh, only draft eligible players. That means guys that finished up all their eligibility in school this year, and then they'll be eligible for the 2015 draft. So um, that'll we'll probably have about 700, 750 guys total work out here. Um, you know, these are guys that obviously are not going to Indianapolis for the National Combine, which is another 300. So between the National Combine and our regional combines, we'll have worked out about 1,000 draft eligible guys. And then the, uh, the other guys that were not eligible for the regional combines had been years past. Now they can apply to our new veteran combine which is open to, as, as the title would suggest, uh, anybody who's not draft eligible. Uh, veterans, you know, hopefully meeting guys that have some uh, professional football experience. Well, I think ultimately for us, it'll be the feedback from our clubs to see if, see if they like the new process. So far, it's been, uh, it's been very positive. Like I said, it streamlines the process, so now they know when they come out here and watch these guys work out, or they go into the system and watch the videos of the workout, they know they're just watching guys who are just draft eligible, nobody else. And, uh, and we think by separating it that way uh, makes, it, makes it easier and more efficient for our clubs and their evaluating talent. Uh, a little bit, uh, there was some feedback and it just felt like you know, that the current system was not accomplishing what it was, what it was meant to. Um, ultimately it has to be a football relevant event. And so uh, you know, if, if clubs aren't uh, excited about it, if they're not attending the combines, uh, then, then it's, it's not working. But we also too wanted to, this isn't a fantasy camp. It's not an open call to anybody who, who wants to work out. Um, that's not fair to the guys out here who are legitimate prospects. So it was, it was to put a process in place that would, that would uh, hopefully uh, weed out some, some of the guys that are not legitimate National Football League prospects. Um, you know, what we're here is, is, is letting guys, giving them the opportunity to showcase their talents for, for all 32 teams, but ultimately letting them chase their dream. And, and everybody, uh, everybody deserves, a, deserves a chance at that, deserves a, a legitimate chance.